Hi guys, it's Nina from VR Focus. Today I'm going to talk to you about Ace Combat 7 Skies Unknown. So this was announced back in 2015 and was showcased at PlayStation Experiences. And since then, I have tried it out at Gamescom this year on the PlayStation VR. Bandai Namco are also the developers behind Project Cars 2. And although that is very highly realistic, it kind of does a lot of similar stuff with Ace Combat 7, even though it's not a simulation game. There is a lot of weather patterns, a lot of things about frost, a lot of things about rain and storms, and it is incredibly realistic with regards to how you have to react as a pilot in a jet fighter when you come or find yourself in these weather patterns like if you go through a particular type of cloud and everything gets stormy everything starts freezing up and you have to leave immediately otherwise you otherwise there's ice on your aircraft which you definitely don't want when you are fighting enemies and you need to see what's around you so this game is very similar to Eve Valkyrie in the sense that you're in a cockpit and you can move around, you can see all of the buttons, there's a lot of detail, this is made in Unreal Engine 4, and you can see the hand moving, you can see all the buttons, but what you're mostly using is your HUD. So you can see where your enemies are, you can lock onto enemies, you've got two different types of missiles, and if you are in close combat, you can also just use a machine gun. However, um, I definitely recommend um, just using the missiles on use unless you are like an extreme pro at flying and you know how to do it. So when I played this at Gamescom, you start off on an aircraft carrier in a a jet fighter and you slowly take off and suddenly you are immediately in a dogfight. You've got allies around you and you have to move your head with the PlayStation VR and you do have a controller and you have to lock onto enemies and destroy them. So it seems like Ace Combat 7 isn't actually, not the whole game is playable in virtual reality. It is just a part where you're fighting enemies in the sky. You can choose to play it in VR and that's kind of where Ace Combat 7 Skies Unknown for VR is specifically for. It's not the whole game, so you don't have a story in VR. It is just the part where you are fighting in the sky and you can sort of lock onto enemies and shoot them down. What I like about the game is that there's things like cloud cover, so if you are being chased by enemies, you can go into the cloud and the radar goes off, the map goes off, you can't actually see where any of the enemies are, but you it means you need to have quick reaction speeds because on some maps you might like hit a wall or a mountain or you might like suddenly dive into the ocean. So you have to be extremely 100% aware of your environment. And this is where I think virtual reality can really shine because it really does make you feel like you're there. You do pay a lot closer attention because it feels like you're really flying. Otherwise, I thought it was a very beautiful game. It looks stunning and you could just fly across the ocean. And and I think if you just enjoy flying, you can really, you can just fly around and just really enjoy the environment and the ocean and the skies and see what it's like being up in the sky. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, share and subscribe. If you are a awesome flyer and you love simulation games and you love being like the jet fighter or a helicopter in other games, definitely give this game a try, especially if you have never tried virtual reality before. You might find that you are extremely good at it or it feels a lot more intuitive. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and I will see you next time.